Hello and welcome to our reflection. I hope the beautiful weather has taken you outside and you've managed to appreciate creation in all its glory as the sun shines, the flowers blossom and the trees are in full flow. I've been lucky enough to get out to a few woodlands recently and it's just wonderful to see nature at work and really appreciate the vastness of creation, the height of the trees. And it took me back to those words in Genesis where it talks about the little animals that scurry on the ground just being just as important as all the others. As we come to this weekend, we'll come to Pentecost and that wonderful gift of the Holy Spirit will be celebrated. And I just pray as we spend a few moments together you can feel the Holy Spirit present with you as you lean into God. Let's just ponder some words and pray together. I'll start by lighting a candle. God is completely sovereign. God is infinite in wisdom. God is perfect in love. God in his love always wills what is best for us. In his wisdom he always knows what is best and in his sovereignty he has the power to bring it about. Let us pray. Dearest Lord, in your kingship, we pray that you take a worldly view of the current situation devastating your world and damaging your children. We pray that the world over you will be in both the minds and hearts of those in power making decisions and individuals making decisions that may affect the life and health of others. Help us to get a grip on this devastating virus, Lord, so it can be eradicated. Give us all wisdom to know the best way to proceed in every aspect of our daily lives. There are all so many unanswered questions. Guide us to make the right choices and decisions. Most of all, Lord, love us. Hold us in your mighty hands. Caress us and let us know that your love surpasses anything else. Love us for who we are, imperfect but trying our best. Amen. <laughs> 